Hello everybody, so back here No Limits 2. Today I'm going to go over the um, editor, um, what everything does and whatnot. Um, now I don't know everything about the editor, like when it comes to terrain and stuff like that, but I'll do the best I can to go over this stuff with you guys. So let's go and get into this guys. Um, so the first thing you want to do, and I should have done this before I even decided to start recording, but oh well, um, is decide a name for your park or coaster. Um, you got you have to have both. Unfortunately, this is a completely new, um, unmade um, editor, as you will, or um, park, as you will. Um, I don't know what you want to call it, but I'm gonna name it something random. I don't know what I want to name it. Probably that work remade. Might as well. <laughs> so this is the coaster properties. Um, I sort of went in this in the last couple of videos, but. It wasn't very um, good at going over this, so you got your scripts um, when it comes to, like, probably making your own stations or um, copying a station from somebody else or a train of yours or whatnot. This is probably where you put them in at, um, I'm assuming. Stats, obviously we have no track or anything set up yet, so that's not going to show but when you have a coaster, it would show you um, all the stats for the um, the coaster or whatnot. Um, the mode, um, I haven't really done much with this, so I really don't know about this. I would not mess with this very much. Um, yeah, I don't mess with that very much unless you know exactly what you're doing. I have no idea about any of this, so I'm not going to go into um, detail about that. But... I'm just going to pick a ba basic wooden coaster for this tutorial. I'm not building an actual coaster yet. Um, if you guys want me to build one, I will try to. Um, last time I tried to build a coaster, it didn't turn out very well, like I said in the last couple of videos. But if you guys want me to, I will. Um, I just have to see um, what I want to do. I'll probably draw a little sketch and show you guys what I think I want to do with it. Um, I really don't know. But definitely let me know in the comments below if you guys want to see that. Um, so let's go ahead and briefly get into this. I'm just going to pick a random um, wooden coaster. Um, so we're going to get into the um, track um, slide. Now I'm going to go over what each individual thing does. The only thing I don't know very well is the add 4 d perimeter. I have no I idea about that. You guys got to look that up. Um, I guess it shows you um, what it does. Um, but I really don't know. I've never um, dealt with that. So... Um, you guys got to figure that out on your own, I guess. Um, so, I'm going to go ahead and go into the top view. Um, you got like, you got like seven different views here. Um, now, I suggest to you when you're building a hill and whatnot, and I'll go over that with you guys um, in later episodes, but when you're building a hill, I highly suggest that you go to the left, back, or front, or right. Um... Mainly because it's way easier and it's very designed to build a hill. And, or there's a different concept you can do with that. And I'll show you guys um, in later videos. I'm going to do a complete hill um, tutorial when it comes to that. So just stay tuned for that. Um, so when it comes to um, starting a coaster. Um, you want to press start vortex. Now you can go anywhere with this. Um, so I'm just going to go and draw a line here. Um, now you want to like put a dot, um, at the end. I don't know what it's for, but it helps with the coaster. Um, so say if this is not straight at all or not aligned properly, there's an easier way to fix that. Um, so you just, um, highlight it and you press, um, make straight 2D top. Now you can also press make straight, but when it comes to the hills, um, there's you always want to press this when it comes to the hills if not make straight just level is it all out so if you're making a hill it's just going to um make it straight with everything else and you just ruin your freaking hill pretty much um so definitely do not do that um like i said i'll explain to you um what happens when you do that in later episodes when i discuss the hills and whatnot um so let's go ahead and go into perspective now 
Another thing, when it comes to adding vortexes, um, that's something you add after you make this. Um, this is pretty much the station. Um, I was I will make the station and possibly make the coaster. I don't know. Um, I don't even know if I want to finish this or not. I just I I have to see. Um, but so every time you want to add a vortex or continue with the coaster, um, you always want to press the arrow down here and press add vortex. Um, so that's another thing. Um, so let's go ahead and go into uh, perspective. Um, so when it comes to, hold on, I'm going to change this real quick. I do apologize. Turns out into spine, so it's not about the G-force. Um, so say if you want to change the height of this. Um, what you want to do is double click and you go into the Y. Um, I usually put it at five or higher, so just five. Um, and it raises it. Now, X and Z, I believe X is left and right, and Z is probably, um, I don't know what Z does, I have to figure that out. Um, I never dealt with Z, so I really don't know. Now, this is one of the ways when it comes to the hills that you can, um, like, um, raise it or lower it. It really is up to you, but there's actually an easier way. And I've always had difficulties when doing that. So, let's just go over here and press the Vigil 5. So it's nice and even here. So you guys can hear my keyboard in the background. It's a loud keyboard. I do apologize about that. Um, so yeah, it's all raised now. It looks okay. Um, so add type separator. Or I should add, talk about insert vertex first. I'm sorry. Um, I'm getting way too um, far ahead here. Um, so say if you want to make like a curve or something... Um, and you forgot to add a vortex, or you want to go, um, like, into the ground and make a tunnel or whatever, you press add vortex, um, obviously I cannot do it right now, maybe I can, um, okay, see, it decided to go a wire, I don't know why it did, um, but, uh, I gotta go into the top real quick, let's go ahead and straighten all this out. Oh, fucking course. I have to select all of it. Um, that's the issue with that. You always have to select all of it or that option would not appear. Um, so that's taken care of. It still does not look right. Oh, it's just lowered a little bit. Um, so let's raise that a little bit. Nope. Gotta click from that or just... This is terrible right now, I know, but it's bothering me right now. <laughs> Alright, so that should be okay. So, when it comes to the add roll, that's if you want to, um, like, curve it. And this is what I mean um, by curving, or like tilting, pretty much. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys real quick what that is. Um, now... Now, I always press no lat G-force because it automatically um, will be as low as possible. So, um, obviously that did not work because it's not a curve or anything. So, let me go um, make a cur real, real quick curve real quick and I'll show you guys what that does. Um, so, at vertex. It's going to be really bad, but this is just for demonstration purposes. What the fuck? Something, something just moved behind me. I don't know what it is. That's fucking weird. There's no wind in here at all. I don't know what it is. Um, see, this ain't... It doesn't... It looks weird. It looks like a hook. <laughs> it really does, or a candy cane. It's not even Christmas yet. It's Halloween. Um, so, this is a good time to, um, go over the, um, element. Um, so what you want to do is select all of it. Now, this could take a really long time depending on how big your track is and how much is selected. So what you want to do is press debunk vertices, vertices, what the fuck am I saying? Vertices, god damn it, I, I give up, just shut up. 
Um, so yeah, as you guys can see, it's moving the coaster out, and it makes a nice looking curve here. And now I'm going to explain to you what the um, add roll does. So you want to place these individually along your um, coaster, or your coaster will get messed up when it comes to the curves and stuff. Um, I'll show you guys what that is and what what happens with it um, in later episodes. Um, so just add rows um, like individually wrong here. So just press no lot G force. It's not gonna work. I don't know why it doesn't work, but it's not. Maybe it has to be faster. I don't know. Um, there is no speed right now. Uh, wait, is there? Oh man, guys. Well, obviously there's not going to be any speed. There's no speed whatsoever, but when you press some um, no G force, um, if you got a good enough speed, um, it will tilt the track like um, like you see on classic wooden coasters. Excuse me, guys. Um, it's really hard to explain. I'll explain to you that and when we actually build a coaster if we do um so i pretty much explained the elements and stuff like that um i don't know what special track is um i guess um, we can find out hold on all right all right so that looks like if you want to build like a double train um station that's what i think you can do um switch track merge um what the fuck is that that looks weird i don't know what it is um i don't know why it is all right so you got your transfer table um i really wouldn't mess with this somebody said that this is what you're supposed to do with it um but i've had really really major issues with this i don't know why I just could not get aligned with the station for whatever reason. Um, it was just wouldn't connect. And I don't know why. Um, so you don't really need any of this. Um, so let's go ahead and delete all this. Um, I don't want to delete the. Um, so I'm just pressing the um, delete button on the keyboard. Uh, it automatically deletes all that. So we don't need that there. Um, so. With it comes to the supports, um, there's only a wooden generator supports. Um, so if you want to go into here, if you got a wooden coaster, um, you could go in here and press generate final, whatever build style you want, and it automatically um, generates the um, the supports for you. Now, when it comes to like steel coasters and whatnot, um, you have to individually make the um, supports, which I don't know very much about that. Um, I had to get in that and show you guys um, later on. I really don't know. Um, the terrain button. I haven't really messed with this um, too much. I had to figure out. Let me see um, what all this does. I've never really experienced with this. Um, so that's recumulate background. Um, Terrain generator. What is this? Um, hmm. Terrain settings. So, say if you want grass. Let, let's do grass. Because that's, that's the only we, thing we have right now. Um, so. So, we're adding auto grass. What? Uh, hold on, guys. I'm trying to figure this out. Maybe there's... I don't know. It, that's going to take too long. i got to figure that out. Um, so, when it comes to the scenery, I slowly went over this um, in last episode. So, I'm not going to go into too detail with this. But, as you guys can see, you can, guys can add trailers. Um... Guys can add various um, station ambient sound. I don't know about that. Um, I'm pretty sure you get to add scripts for that. I really don't know anything about that. 
Um, so I have to go and see what that is and whatnot. So you can add trees and plants. Um, so say if you want to add grass, you can. I'm sorry, but that would take too fucking long. Um, so, as you guys can see, you get a grass, um, park, I sort of win this, you got the basic set, um, you got a trash cans, um, benches, park lamps, stuff like that, um, you got the demo objects, buildings, background, um, what the fuck did I just do? Um, <laughs> what is this? What the fuck? Oh, you can add power poles. Seems legit. Oh, shit. Did not mean to do that. I'm trying to delete this. Hold on a minute, guys. Um, just fuck it. I'm not dealing with this. Um, I don't know very much about this. Um, environment editor. It uh, depends on what you want to do with it. Um, you get the background and whatnot. I really don't know anything about that. You can really fuck up your game doing this. So, I really wouldn't mess with that too much. Unless you absolutely know what you're doing. Light, light, light pattern. Um, texture. I don't know about this either. Um, so, like I said. Um, don't mess with this too much. Um, so, because you display. Um, I don't know. You can decide what you want with this. You can disable or enable something you got the snap you got the grid if you want um with this you can choose if you want the um speed comb jiggy force comb or um spine or even none if you want um when it comes to the view um you can show the road roll panel support panel preferred panel stuff like that this is all your panels um you got the editor. Um, I don't know why this is. Or what this is, even. So, don't mess with that too much. And this is just your file. Um, I thought there was a way you could... Hmm, how am I, guess? Um, I don't know. I can't... I can't remember how you do this. But there is a way that you can have multiple slides at once. I just cannot remember how you do that. Um, so I will learn how to do that in later videos and show you guys how you do that. Um, so yeah, um, that will do it for us today, guys. I'll see you guys later. Bye. <laughs>